This is the best one you can get on TikTok. It's the most advanced. A great tool to have in the car. I've got loads more to show you, but I'm just going to plug this in and show you how to use it. So this is the connection, right? On my van, it's underneath here. But most vehicles, it will be under here somewhere. That's mostly where it's going to be. So we're going to plug it in. We'll turn on. The OBD machine will turn on. Now, how it works, some vehicles you may have to start and some you will leave as they are. So we're just going to get that in position. Right, I'm going to show you. There's all these different settings. So this is to read. Excuse that. This is read, data stream, data library. So you can store stuff on here. Review, setup. Don't worry about that. That's just like beeping and color and stuff on the screen. And then voltage. But, you know, you can check your battery, for example. That's good. If that's below 11.4... Generally, you've got a low battery or you've got a dodgy alternator. So if you're having trouble starting your car, you can do a reading. At 11 plus, you should be able to start the car. So there's nothing wrong with my alternator and nothing wrong with my battery. That's all good. Now it's reading. Right, one code found. Okay, and that's what it's going to do it's going to reset it but you can read the faults it will google them you can google them now look it's been cleared right now there is some more advanced settings in this but let's have a look at vehicle info so this will tell you the vin number if you don't know where to look for it collaboration but if you need your vin number you can use this machine to find your vin number that might be for the main dealer or something yeah and that can help you get paint codes and all sorts and then you can do live data reading which will tell you all the diagnostics. I mean, this is more advanced. You don't really need to understand this as a DIY person, but this is gonna tell you CO emissions and all of that sort of stuff in there as well. So it's a very good buy, very good product. Uh, I'd highly recommend it. You can plug it in online and update it as well.